Hey, what's up, fellows? Yes, it's me. If you're stuck at the help desk right now, pay attention. Most help desk techs stall. They stay stuck in tickets. They lose years and thousands of dollars in income. That doesn't have to be you. If you keep watching, you'll know exactly what to do this week to start climbing instead of just spinning in tier one. So why most of the help desk techniques technicians fail to level up. Here's the reality. Most help desk technicians think a few years in tickets automatically leads to promotion. It doesn't. And here's why. Staying is a repetitive task. You spend all day fixing passwords, unlock accounts, and resetting PCs. That's valuable, but only for entry-level pay. Waiting for someone else to notice you. Promotions don't happen by accident. If you're waiting for your manager to notice your efforts in Tier 1, you're waiting forever. Focusing on the wrong skills. Tickets alone won't get you into systems, cloud, or security roles. Employers want people who have actually touched actual systems and tools. If this sounds like you, it's okay. Most people are in the same trap, but traps are meant to be escaped. Now let's talk about the good part. What actually pays more than help desk right now and how to get there? Step one, target the right roles. Don't chase titles, chase leverage. Roles that pay more are closer to the infrastructure, systems, or business impacts. Junior system administration, cloud support, identity and access management, security operations, enterprise application support, and IT operations. These roles are not harder, they just give more value to the business. And that's what raises pay. Step number two, Build practical leverage. You need skills that you can show, not just certifications. Small hands-on projects are enough to prove competence. Set up a small Active Directory lab. Deploy a virtual machine. Configure users and groups. Use free cloud tools to manage simple workloads. Even one or two simple projects will make your resume stand out. Step number three, leverage certification strategically. Not every certification is equal. Focus on ones that actually get you hired fast. Google IT support for foundational credibility, CompTIA Network Plus for networking skills, Azure Fundamentals or AWS Cloud Practitioner for cloud roles, Security Plus for security adjacent roles. These certifications show employers you're ready to take the next step without waiting years. Step number four, your resume should focus on impact, not just ticket Accounts. Highlight what you have built, maintained, and improved. Include labs and projects. Mention actual systems you have touched. Apply for adjacent roles, even if you don't meet every single bullet. Confidence plus proof of hands-on skills goes further than a perfect checklist. Step number five, position yourself for an interview. When you get interviews, frame your help desk experience as a leverage. Don't just say, I resolve tickets. Say, I implemented process and tools that improved user experience and reduced downtime. And that's how you move from cost center to revenue enabler. And that's what employers pay for. Before you take action, ask yourself these questions. Which real system have I used, configured, or maintained? Can I demonstrate my skills outside of tickets? Am I ready to invest a few hours in a lab and small projects this week? Does my resume reflect impact and not just tasks? If you answer yes, you are ready. If no, start with small wins immediately. Every lab 
every project, every certification matters. So here's the bottom line. Help desk is not a career. It's a bridge. Most people get stuck. Don't be most people. Start building your leverage now. Focus on adjacent roles, apply strategically, and make the decisions before the market makes it for you. If you want to actually practice these skills, check out my hands-on lab playlist. It is step-by-step step and beginner-friendly. Exactly what you need to pivot out of help desk quickly. And if you want more career strategies to get hired faster in IT, subscribe. This is what this channel is all about. Until next time, take care of yourselves and others around you. And I'll see you in my next video. Take care. Bye-bye.